Carolyn Pettit, we just saw Need for Speed Most Wanted. Not to be confused with Need for Speed Most Wanted. Well, that's the 360 game. Right. So w the one we're talking about right. is, is the, the, Xbox the Xbox 360, 360 game. Need for Speed Most Wanted, right. parentheses, 2012. <laughs> right. The one, by, the one by Criterion, I think. That's the important thing here. This game has Criterion's influence, yeah, apparently, absolutely. just all, all through it. All up in. <laughs> um, I mean, so, so let's, let's talk about that. I mean, we've... Uh, obviously, they, they did a previous Need for Speed game. They did mm -hmm. Hot Pursuit a few years ago. Kind of showed that they can take some of the elements of Burnout and kind of mix them with more of the pure racing of the Need for Speed series. Right. And here, I think they're... It seems to me like they're layering in more Burnout stuff. There was you know, times when, during the gameplay demo, uh, the player took out police cars and the, the camera would kind of pan and show them wrecking in yeah. a very, very traditional kind of Burnout way. <clears throat> um, which, you know, is, is as a huge fan of the Burnout series, I mean, kind of the more Burnout they can mix in there yeah. without just making another Burnout game, um, the, the better as far as I'm concerned. One of the things that really excited me about this game is that it's open world. Yeah. Um, Need for Speed Hot Pursuit was great. Um, it was more of like, it was sort of like an open map is right. how I would look at it. It yeah. was like, it was sort of all these different tracks that right. were vaguely interconnected. But there weren't routes kind of interwoven enough to really give you a whole right. lot of flexibility. Exactly, yeah. And in this, it really seems like, you know, it, during the event uh, that we saw, there was, a, there was a clear finish line, I think, that mm -hmm. the player needed to get to, but it seemed like there were many opportunities for you to kind of choose your own path as for, as for how to get there. And we saw the player just dr drive up like steps kind of along the side of the road right. and do things like that, kind of go off the beaten path yeah. to uh, more effectively elude the, uh, the police. So obviously, you know, being chased by the police is a, a big, big part of Most Wanted. Um, one thing I'm, I'm, I'm a little wary about, having played Need for Speed Most Wanted on the Xbox 360. Right, not to be confused with Need, Need for, for Speed, Speed Most, Most Wanted, Wanted on the Xbox right. 360. Is that that, uh, that that earlier game had a, a, a really great kind of tongue-in-cheek, full motion video kind of story. Right. And I don't think this game needs to, needs to kind of duplicate that, but I'm just wondering, like, will it have any story, you know, what is the story going to be like? Because the... Um, the presenter said, you know, in this game, your goal is to become the uh -huh. most wanted among your friends. Yeah. Um, and they're really pushing the whole auto log uh, aspect of it, um, which, the, you know, he says it makes everything a competition. And even during the, the, um, the, the gameplay demo, uh, I periodically would see the, the kind of auto log uh, leaderboard pop up and mm. show how what he was doing affected his performance. And that's all well and good. I, I love that kind of social competition, but I also hope that it has a kind of story where you feel like you're really facing off against, you know, maybe specific other racers or people who have some personality. Right. And, yeah. Okay. Um, well, I guess we'll, we'll find we out, will. won't we? We will find out. In fact, I think uh, I have the release date here. It's actually coming out October 30th. October so, 30th. So we don't, have, we don't have too long to wait, but um, it still feels like a long time to me for right now. When a game looks that good, it feels yeah. like it's going to be a long it time looks, to wait. Yeah, uh, it looks super fun. So.